name is Nick Redding. I'm the founder and executive director of SAFE, uh, sponsored Arts for Education. And we run three theatre companies in Kenya, and we've reached uh, but somewhere between 900,000 and a million people since we've been working. We work with probably the most disadvantaged communities in Kenya. Safe Ghetto in the slums in Nairobi, Safe Pwani, which means Safe Coast, which tours all over Coast Province, and Safe Ma, which works with the Maasai up in the Loiter Hills. All right. We've got the most incredible team of, of young Kenyans working in the three different companies who all come from the communities we work in and they understand the communities. <laughs> We go out with the uh, Simbaropa, who are lion drummers, and uh, uh, drum through the streets, literally drumming up the audience. Even just pulling the stage out, and, and it's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a mobile stage, it thrills people. They are trying to speak in the, about real life situation that uh, we as youth, we are passing through. Early pregnancies, we're talking about early marriages, HIV, AIDS. We're talking about bad parenting. <laughs> Theatre is probably the most effective form of education you can have. When you are really moving people and when you are making them laugh, then they will hear messages that they would otherwise ignore. They're morality tales um, and they inspire people to make the positive choice in their lives. <laughs> So after the performances, we come back to the same site whereby we offer other services, workshops on life skills, condom demonstration, and also VCT, where it's voluntary counseling and testing. We, we feel empowered that they trust us, and through that trust, they are able to, to open up and discuss issues which they'll never discuss in the family. Last year, we, in 39 follow-up days, we tested more people than Melindi District Hospital. And out of the people who tested positive, 100% enrolled into a treatment program. For the near future with Seipwani, we're trying to develop a mobile clinic to uh, go around with the theatre, um, actually providing primary health care. The STARS Award will give us some of the training required to give us the skills to actually get this clinic going. <laughs> Don't worry, be happy now. It is good because they have changed our lives. We have learned more. I love it, and I will say that they should continue with that spirit. In fact, I'll run coming to see them. 